is the energy vibration reading for the Leo Sun Moon Horizon sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, it is the month of March 2018, and the month is a water month, emotional month, with the energy of the hangman in upright position, which is very good. I want to say thank you to each and every person. Thank you for the likes, shares, and support, and thumbs up. I want to say to each and every person, I am um, available for reading, um, but it takes 72 hours. So I'm sorry for that, but um, for the rest, it's, it's good. Um, I want to say to each and every person, please remember to listen to the general reading and your sun and moon and rising sign. And please remember to like, share these reading, okay? Um, we have five weeks in this month, so we are going to go straight in your readings because these readings are a little bit longer than normal. Um, you have the energy of the magician. This is good infinity abundancy. So what you guys are doing is trying to bring out whatever the situation is and to open the doors to infinity abundance in your life. And this is going to be good. So um, the energy of the magician is the energy of a hair sign, but this hair sign is coming in to bring you a lot of luck. Okay. You have the energy of the eye princess coming up. Whatever the situation is, whatever that was transpiring in your life, your spirit guides and angels are here um, to help you through whatever is transpiring. Okay, so um, if you are feeling down and out, if you feel betrayed by people and that sort of a thing, your spirit guides are here. In the second week, you have the energy of the hangman in the upright position, which is the energy of the month. So this is good. This is wonderful. So um, let's see what the angels and guides have for you um, guys, for you Leos for the third week. You have the energy of the Seven of Cups. This is a wonderful energy. Um, I love, I, you know, I basically love this card because this is saying that a lot of new opportunities are going to be coming up for you. A lot of new positive opportunities are going to be coming up for you and then as we move forward um, the ten of cups comes in for uh, so this is just going to be wonderful and then um, in the fifth week you have the energy of the eight another infinity so if you look at this you have um, three eights or you have uh, um, this is eight and another eight so let's look and see because you're working hard a lot of you are going to be working hard as to bring in your family in balance um, if there is imbalance if there is um, imbalance or whatever the imbalance is of was then you are seeing all of this coming out okay so let's look and see whatever what it is that is happening because the energy of the angman is really upright so this is just so wonderful and just so beautiful i love whenever the energy of the hangman is upright yeah the light the the, the lightning is so weird <laughs> i don't know what is happening so um okay you have two major arcana and these major arcana is always um your spirit guides are here the energy of the magician is here and this is good because it's going to affect everyone because whenever the energy of the magician comes up is that um the universe is, is as if the gods um the magicians are coming in to help you to bring forward what it is you want to bring forward so as we look at the energy of the eye princess and uh, um, you know you're finding yourself this is a positive energy because you have the four of pen the eight of Pentacles now whatever is transpiring for you Leah's it's gonna be good because with the energy of the the eight of Pentacles twice coming up in your reading and the energy of the magician with infinity sign is this is a very very positive 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 sign that is coming up so it's as if if you you know have been out of work for some times and that sort of a thing and you have been trying to balance out your life and that sort of a situation then this is going to be happening because you are going to be um, you know receiving um, 
wonderful new positive things and this is going to be good because in the the you know the adjoining week which is the second to the third week which you're finding yourself and you're realizing who you are and you're realizing the you know in a power that you carry you are seeing and you know a lot of love is going to be coming to you a lot of love for the people who have kids this is going to be good because um they are going to be showing you how much they appreciate you and how much they are really really feeling good about who you are how much they appreciate you and how much things have been so good and things are happening um for you and you know they're so happy um, how you have come through a, a situation and a period in your life and the changes that you self are making your kids are going to be very happy um, you know they're going to be realizing how gift and how um, grateful that you are their parents so whatever is happening um, you are seeing um, a positive side to your kids if you don't have kids this is a lot of love coming to a lot of from a lot of people who have seen you gone through so many things but yet still you still have the light and power to push through all whatever that has transpired in your life and this is going to be good money is coming um, to you and um, some of you are going to get message receive message that money is coming to you so this is this is going to be good let's see there's a happy family um, happiness and joy the ten of cups in the fourth week this is good this is um, extremely good with the ten of cups in the four weeks is a positive energy so let's see what is happening justice justice happen this is wonderful this is good so there is happiness and joy and you're going to be working hard there's you know happiness and joy you're going to be working hard whatever the situation is whatever that was happening whatever that was transpiring justice comes up to finally end the month and end the week so if you had um a family situation that has transpired with you that was so injustice um, this is going to be coming up and this is going to be extremely good let's see what's happening in the first half of the month for you guys you have the energy of the knight of swords the energy of the knight of Swords, and this energy of the knight of swords is someone and people who are coming at you and you know trying to to bully you and, and, and this sort of a thing and you're just gonna stand up there and look and think you know really seriously I don't think so you know this is the sort of a thing don't let people because you know you are the Leo's so you are the one who you know have the power and use the power and use your mouth and whatever is transpiring whoever is coming at you to you know like fight you down and bully you down you are going to realize that you are going to stand up to these people and said hey listen uh, this is not going to happen okay and this is good to let people know how far to go with you okay and in the last part of the week the last part of the month sorry there is going to be positive energies coming in and with these positive energies what is going to transpire is that you're going to be working together with other people you are going to be working together with other people and by working together with other people and you know because there's a lot of opportunities that are coming up and people are going to be asking you to work together with them and then what is going to happen and what is going to transpire it is that you are going to see that by working with other people because um, the energy of money is coming to you money is coming to you um, um, you know in the first three weeks some people will have it you know in the first week some people would have it but in the second week some people will have it in the third week but money is coming to you so it is um, going to be an you know extremely positive positive um, month I'm looking at this and I'm seeing what is going on because whatever that is here and whatever that is transpiring um, you know the energy of justice is here and it's as if justice came in and stand up against an injustice situation that was happening that were that was occurring 
a justice came up and stand up against an, an injustice situation that has been happening and this is this is really good this is really um, you know positive for you guys because whatever that has come out of the month of February or whatever uh, situations because whenever the eye princess comes up in a reading and she has been coming up for you fire sign people because this is the month of you know emotions this is more of uh, you making sure that things are vibrating in a good um, energy vibration it is as if you are deciding that you know you're taking the ropes to your life you're you are the one that is going to make decision and no one else you know you're standing up to whatever injustice that has transpired against you and you're understanding how you are going to deal with the situation and what is going to happen in the situation because whatever the situation that has transpired in your life before you are deciding that uh, you know this is not going to be happening again uh, it is this month is an emotional month the month of March five weeks a lot of emotion a lot of situations where um, people and situations that you know a lot of whatever that you have given out is coming back and it depends on what you have given out and how you have given it out because that's what will be transcurring that's what will be coming back to you and you need to understand that with the energies that are going around now you need to understand that whatever we um, we give out that is what we receive that comes back to us and um, you know your month is ending with the, the energy of justice and with the energy of justice with your month ending with the energy of justice and you have the energy of the magician um, for the month what is transpiring is that actually what they're saying and what is going to happen for you is that there are things that is going to be transpiring in your life and it depends on how you have given out this karma before because that's how the karma is going to come back to you so let's actually look and see what is happening um, for the love people um, a lot of you know it's the second time I'm seeing this energy that a lot of people are worried you need to ask for help you need to ask for help whatever the situation is you need to ask for help whatever is happening you need to ask for help whoever um, is dealing with a situation you need to ask for help you need to call upon your angels and guides and ask them to send you help and release yourself of worries okay ask your angels and guides for divine intervention and for them to send you help and stop worrying let's look at the love energies for um, each and every um, you know person so we're first going to call upon the angels and love for the Leo's to show us what is happening for the Leo's people in the love arena in the month of March 2018 um, the Leo's wonderful the Leo's okay okay um, let's see what is happening for the ladies over 40 for you Leo's over 40 you have the energy of the seven of cups what is the energy of the seven of cups there's a lot of fishes in the sea ladies so if you have been looking for something looking for someone um, you know throwing your little fish rod out there is a lot of fish to catch because you have all six and two eight you know a lot of people are leaving um, relationships behind whatever the situation is I'm seeing it's an emotional month and a lot of people are leaving a lot of relationships behind so, so you Leo ladies because you have here the energy of the eight of cups which you're leaving an emotional situation behind and you're moving forward this is good because whenever we stand in situation whenever we try to stay in a situation and that sort of a thing <coughs> you are just going to be walking away from a situation whatever 
this situation is whatever emotion that it brings to you it has something the, the effect of love because this is the love read and you are going to be walking away from some situation not all of you but some of you are going to decide that this isn't working for me and I'm leaving this behind and moving on to um, something else and you know um, it's good to do that because if something isn't working it's just isn't working and sometimes we stay in um, situation because we're hoping that things will change and you know it's not going to change when we look at the energy for the Leo men over the age of 40 we also have another seven so two four six one seven um, whatever is happening for you Leo men um, in a relationship you're protecting yourself um, you Leo men are protecting yourself whatever the situation is whatever that was transpiring <laughs> that was happening um, you are protecting yourself and this is good for you to protect yourself because whatever that has transpired um, you're not opening up yourself to love anymore you are protecting yourself you're you know old and everything off of base and you're not opening up your heart to love you're protecting your heart because of whatever that has happened and whatever that has transpired you decided not to, to open up to love in any way any matter any form okay and this is good as we move forward we have the energy of the latest between the ages of 25 and 40 um, and a lot of you are turning your backs I'm not sure what is happening with you guys you ladies between the ages of 25 and 40 but there seems to be a situation with you fire sign people that you're turning your backs on relationship and people um, some of you have been dealing with the king of wands um and this could be your father um in a situation but this is like a relationship that you leo women was in a relationship with someone who was a aries a leo or a sagittarius and you're turning your back on this person um i'm seeing this coming up for a lot of leo people um uh, for a lot of you that you're turning your back because the, actually you know whatever is transpiring so let's see why are you ladies in this month turning your backs on you know because you know you're turning your back on someone who is of your own sign so let's see why because you have the intuition and guidance that you don't need to have this in your life you you know you really don't need this sort of a thing in your life and you're turning your back on it the energy of heartbreaks comes up the energy of outbreak comes up and it is a karmatic situation okay so some of you have had heartbreaks and you have to deal with um, a man that was um, a Leo a Aries or a Sagittarius and it was heartbreak and you know your intuition and guidance is you turn you have turned your back on this situation and move away from the situation which is very good as we look forward we are looking at the energy of the knight of wands this is someone who is between the ages of 25 and 40 and you have to deal with a situation in organization sometimes it is divorce and sometimes it is going to court about a situation um, a relationship or a marriage um, it can be divorce and um, whatever the situation is these you know you, you 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 need really to have inner strength and guidance because whatever it, it, you know it can be marriage too um but it is the month of march i don't know how many people get married in the month of march so it could be a child custody court um court airing and that sort of a thing and you really really need to understand what is going on you really need to understand what has transpired in your life and this sort of a thing so whatever has happened and whatever has transpired um, something is happening here and I'm going to ask a question to see what exactly had transpired who or what what has transpired while you're going towards uh, okay okay so 
whoever this knight of wands is between the ages of 25 and 40 um, whatever the situation was you are getting divorced your relationship has fallen apart you're getting divorced um, you're getting divorced because of something that transpired this is the end of a relationship because the energy of the tower is here so it's a divorce it can be that you have abused your wife or you have abused whatever situation is is and here you're seeing that it is as blown up on you it has exploded in your face whatever is happening it has exploded in your face because it can be a divorce um, a situation where um, you're getting divorced um, because the energy of the organization and the tower so it says is the end of something you're getting divorced and this is you know this is going to be tragic this is going to be extremely tragic whatever has transpire um, this is going to be extremely tragic because the energy of the tower is here okay so whatever it is whatever that has transpired in your life you know you have to understand the situation and whatever is happening because uh, here is a really 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 a situation where everything blows up in your face okay um, let's look at uh, your money situation in this month um, which is good let's look at your money situation you have the four of Pentacles so you have financial balance and you have the ace of Pentacles so this is going to be good okay so wonderful wonderful because you have the energy of the four of Pentacles so you're balancing out your financial situation which is going to be extremely good a uh, four of Pentacles in a money reading is very good because what that is is saying is that it's not that you're holding on on your financial situation it's that you're trying to use it to balance out and make sure that everything is paid money is coming in so this is wonderful you have the ace of Pentacles um, new um, you know money your um, whatever materialistic needs you want it's going to happen for you whatever the materialistic needs that you want it's going to happen for you and then you have the energy of um, balancing out also your emotional self so this is good because once your emotional self is in balance once first your money is in balance and more money is coming in this is good because um, with all these balance so here you are balancing out your financial situation more money is expected and you have the energy of the four of cups which is a positive energy so here we are um, for you guys this is going to be extremely good um, and, and and whatever is transpiring in your financial world this is going to be good because I'm not seeing the energy of people having new jobs in um, but what I'm seeing is that whatever injustice whatever imbalance your spirit guides are here helping you okay your money looks good um, you know only for the men between the ages of 25 and 40 um, who are getting divorced or who are getting separated and that sort of a thing um, this is here happening for you um, for the ladies there's heartbreak um, for the ladies you're thinking I'm leaving the situation behind and you know you got a heart broken and you're leaving a situation behind and you're listening to your intuition and guidance and make this decision in love let's move on and see whatever else is happening for you guys um, let's go so let's see whatever else is happening for you guys um, let's see what is working for you guys you have the energy other opinion are less important than my personal guidance system this is so so wonderful now I'm serious because a lot of people and especially you know um, you know people always think that you know that make other people opinion hurt their feelings don't do that I've learned whatever somebody else thinks about me that's your opinion it has nothing to do with me that's what you think deal with it I don't have to deal with it so um, and it's seriously because I was the most I was so sensitive 
I used to think whatever someone opinion what opinion someone has of me and I used to think about I'm like who are you why, why you know your opinion doesn't you know seriously if you don't do that you're just gonna just feel bad about yourself when you know it's not something that you can do to change you didn't intend to use the opinion of others to measure against your beliefs desire or action in order to determine the appropriation of them instead you know and still remember long after you were born that it was the relationships between the opinion or the knowledge of the source within you and your current thoughts in any moment so you know people opinion you shouldn't let people opinion get to you because a lot of people makes people opinion gets to you let them keep their opinions to themselves if you have never asked for their opinion why is it they're given it you know who are they to you know make um, make somebody else feel bad and that is so so I don't understand people sometimes you know people step over their own foot because sometimes they're given an opinion about yourself and they need to look at themselves before they start to give opinions so, and um, you know as you look forward in any moment that would offer you perfect um, guidance in the form of your emotional guidance system okay so this is good because a lot of people are listening to other people opinion and this is giving you all sort of a sleepless night and that sort of a thing no don't do that you know um, I mean every, everyone have the right to you know their opinion but you know as far as I'm concerned if you don't ask for it why would someone want to give it to you you know huh. heartbeat I love this energy of heartbeat I'm sorry and this is very early <laughs> um, it's just 10 o'clock <laughs> heartbeat this is good because what is happening is that some of you are going to be feeling the pulse beat of the your heart you know you're going to realize oh my god I mean you know you're going to really find your true inner self in this month for you guys it's about finding who you are it's about your spirit guides it's about them letting you see knowing who you are understanding who you are you're gonna feel the heartbeat of who you truly are vibrating on a high energy vibration and I'm saying to you guys go for it feel what it is to know who it is who you are whenever you know who you are and you stand up for yourself and you understand what is going on then you will be okay okay so let's look at this so, the hurt isn't this wonderful this is beautiful okay so it's it's a month of grounding for you guys but yet still with the energy of the magician so this is a positive month for you guys because whatever is happening you have the energy of the hurt and the energy of the earth is a super energy to have because whenever the energy of the hurt comes up it is um, actually teaching you how to ground yourself because you know the energy of the hurt is so um, there is so much transition that is going on with the energy of the hurt so um, this is good and you know whenever a sign and an energy as the hurt comes up this is saying to you that wonderful experiences are going to be transpiring in your life which is you know extremely good because you know this deck I actually love this deck because um, there is just so many wonderful wonderful um, things because you know the earth is the energy of stability security and abundancy it is the energy of the hurt nurturing life and promises long um, leisure pleasure the things we need the things we want and the material and um, temporary things we valued are 
expressed here so whenever the energies of the hurt come the hurt is slow and sure to take uh, you know the hurricane and everything that comes over but whenever things start to be good it's, it's 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 just wonderful so for you leos it's as if this month is going to bring stability and balance to your materialistic world because you have the fair four pentacles you have the ace of pentacles and once your financial situation is in balance then you have the energy of balancing your emotions so this is going to be wonderful so congratulations you guys and i want to say to you guys um have a wonderful month namaste